Shamir, you know what's been happening with me? I've had a little bit of an eye issue. Did I tell you about that? No. I'll tell you off camera, but I haven't been seeing the ball that well. I've been like framing more balls. I'm not seeing it as well mm -hmm. as I used to okay. because of my eye problem. And I got to make sure I wear sunglasses more than I normally do. I don't like wearing sunglasses when I play. Yeah. But in any case, like since my eyesight is not as good as it used to be, I have this thing right here, the Sabre. Ever seen this? It's the smallest racket in the world. Yeah. I think and I would like to play out a few points against you with the Sabre and see how I do. Okay. I honestly don't think I got a chance with this thing. I think you're going <laughs> to smoke me. I don't know. Dude, there's no chance. Look how small this is. I know. But I think what will happen is that I will hyper focus on a ball and this will work on my vision, my eyesight. And I'll hit the ball cleaner once I grab my racket. All right. So let's play out a few points with this, okay? All right. Sounds good. I honestly don't think I'll be able to make contact, but I think it's great training. I cannot believe I'm making contact. I'm so surprised. But again, I'm hyper focusing on the ball. This is great. Uh, all right, here we go, Shamir. Let's test this out from the baseline. Oh, I'm really like hyper focusing on the ball. I'm watching it like a hawk. It's so far so good. I'm not doing that bad, actually. Let me try to blast one. Yeah, it's not bad at all. Yeah, I'm going to serve to you first. We'll play with points. Oh, you're going to serve with that racket? I'm going to play with some points with this racket, yes. Okay. Here we go. Nice, Shamir. Go for it, Shamir. Why aren't you running for it, man? Oh, no, no, come on, Nick. Nice rally, Shamir. Shamir, make the ball. Come on, more effort, more intensity, Shamir. You're standing around too much. Are you sure? Now don't cheat me now. This is, with the, I got the saber. You gonna cheat me on top? No, 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 no. No, okay. I believe you. It was long. All right. There was a good rally though. That's Had a couple finally. of couple of decent backhands. Show me what happened, man. I don't know. I was. Never, you, I was you're not trying to run around your backhand on the first serve, right? I think I was. But even though I'm using the saber, you know I'm still serving kind of quick. Yeah, I know. Don't run around your backhand on first serves ever. That's, That's the number one point. rule of returning first serves. Don't forget that. Don't ever run around. Yeah. Oh, and he oh. does it again. Right away, he does it again. I know. Shamir, what in the world, man? It was body. It was a body serve. But what? Okay, so if it's body, even more reason to not try to get around it, but just put your racket right here and do a, bo do a block. Dude, I want to test the saber. I'm playing better than I expected. I need, really I need you to get some balls back in play. Come on, man. Oh, there's the first frame. Nice rally, Shimmy. I like that. You're playing really well. Like your serve is still fast, and it's still, and you're still hitting your spots. So it's still really hard to return. But this is good because I'm hyper focusing on the ball, and I'm making good contact. This is good. Show me that was on purpose. I meant to hit it right there. You hit the net though, no? Oh, I was going for a little angle right there. Oh, you were? But you did clip the net though. No, I'm just kidding. It was a mashank. Oh, it was a shank? Yeah. Oh, okay. I believe you. Yeah. Now, the footwork is crucial when you're playing with a racket head this small. Yeah. You really got to move your feet. I didn't on that back end. Oh, no. That was too good. Again, Shamir. Come on. That was a good serve. All right. Be ready back there.
From here. In the corners, you gotta put more spin, dude. More top spin in the corners on the forehand. I don't relax back there. I'm playing pretty good with the saber. I'm very concentrated right now. Like I'm I'm fully focused because I gotta make clean contact. Yeah, I can feel So that. you be ready back there. High intensity. Come on. I know that. High intensity, my friend. Here we go. You're not taking it easy on me at all. Dude, I'm testing the saber, man. I gotta play all out. I thought that I was gonna play terrible with it, but I'm surprising myself. What are you coming in for, Shamir? Stay back. You need a smaller head size. It's too big. You can't do smaller than this. Look at this thing. I'm trying to freaking not slice it. Let's take a little break, okay? Guys, I highly recommend the Sabre racket. You can take a look at how small the racket head is. This really forces you to focus in on the ball and not only work, on your vision and seeing the ball better, but it also forces you to move your feet better to play with more intensity. Oh, no way! But Shamir, look where you're standing, dude. Do you remember our last lessons or no? Why are you standing so close to the middle? <clears throat> Shamir, cover the corner. Staying closer to the alley, man. You got a wide open hole right there. Second. <clears throat> You're literally standing in the middle of that side from here. Shami, I gotta tell you. Yeah. This thing is phenomenal. It's 300 grams, 10.5 ounces. Yeah. It's got a 37 square inch head. Mm. And I'm telling you, I'm focusing so hard, hit the ball clean, I'm working really hard. Yeah. It's very good training. Emma, you want to try? Yeah. Here. It's a bit hard. It looks easy. It's actually not as hard as I thought it would be. You see, like on the spoon, with the spoon, the spoon is so hard. I think the strings make the bigger difference. Oh, you guys never met? No, but I know you. He's famous. He's very famous. Oh my goodness. That's strange. It's strange, right? Clean. Go, Emma, go. Oh, that was a clean forehand, though. It's not bad, right? Yeah, the racket feels really good. It's, it's balanced really well. Yeah. Oh, play, play. Go again, go again. Sorry. Go second, Shamir. Yeah, 11, 11 o'clock, right on top of your head. Kick it in, okay? Good. Uh, uh, play, play. Play. What do you think, Emma? I like it. It's not bad, right? Your forehand looks so clean. I know. It's such a it's such a like well-made racket. It's like graphite. Yeah. It's really surprising, isn't it? Yeah, I'm really surprised. I think it's I actually think it's really good training because I'm like working my butt off. And you're like really trying hard to to see the ball, right? Yes. Yeah, I agree. Shami, are you ready to try it now? Okay. All right, come on. I don't know if I can do. I'm going to I'm going to feed you, okay? Hyper focus on the ball, Shami. Hyper focus. Be on your toes. Come on, small steps. Wow, look at this, Shamir. You're on fire, man. Again. Come on, another one, come. Shamir, it's beautiful, man. You're playing well with this thing. You're seeing the ball well. If Vavrinka is in the house, look at these shots. Nice, backhand. Shamir, this is beautiful job, man. 
All right, swap it out with your racket. Go. Here we go. Come. Good, Shamir. Come on. Come on, trust the backhand. Here we go. Trust the shot, Shamir. Trust it. Here we go. And one more. Come on. <clears throat> Guys, it feels like I'm never going to frame another shot again with my regular racket after practicing with the Sabre. I highly recommend this racket. It's a high quality product and it's a great training tool. It's going to make you track the ball more accurately. It's going to make you work harder with your feet and overall it's going to make you concentrate a lot more. So click the link in the description and get yourself a functional tennis Sabre.